Hello and welcome to my Tarot Corner. So as I told you, I am not concentrated enough to follow all of the videos that are coming out, but I couldn't not see that Netflix keep on uh, changing their minds about when the uh, Sussex's Netflix docu-series will come out. So first they said that it comes out in December, no matter what. Now uh, articles are coming out that the Sussexes are demanding changes and they want this to be delayed. Uh, uh, Harry wants it to come out when, he, when his book comes out. Uh, and the question is why are they putting all of these uh, articles in the mainstream ma media unless they have two possible reasons. One could be that they just don't want uh, to be seen as if they are weak they want to be seen stronger than uh, the uh, Sussexes and that they are the one who decided the date and that is what is going to happen. The next one, the next option is that they are going to postpone it and they are trying to save face by putting all of those uh, Puff pieces uh, telling us that the Sussexes are the one who demanded that. Now, this docuseries is not, not uh, an, uh, something that they are enthusiastic about. Many people say that it is very, very boring, nothing really to, uh, nothing new, nothing, no context at, content at all. Uh, so the question is why delay it or why stay with it at the same, uh, and just put it on? Is it cutting losses? Is it uh, trying to save face, as I said? I don't know. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a Celtic cross and look into that. Uh, in previous readings, I got that they will postpone it. So what I want to see, to, to see is the entire energies around that. The best way to do that is by doing the Celtic cross. And actually my teacher always says that Celtic cross is the best way of doing a, a reading. So that, that is what I'm going to do. And I'm using another animal tarot uh, with the panther oracle, which is very easy to use. So let's see what does the animal tarot tell us. Clearing the deck and my disclaimer, this is my tarot reading. It is vibrational, it is open to interpretation. It exists as assumptions and speculation, and as such, may or may not be true. So please do your own research and decide for yourselves. Now, I really apologize if I get mixed up with words. I'm on very, very uh, strong painkillers. So sometimes it's not too easy for me to concentrate. Okay, so let's start with what is going to happen with the Netflix docu-series of the Sussexes. Why do they keep putting out that the Sussexes want it to postpone? Are they meaning to broadcast it at, uh, before Christmas as they planned? Or are they using the fact that the Sussexes object? to delay it. So what is going on with the Sussexes docu-series by Netflix? So if we remember, I did a reading looking into whether or not it is, what is the right thing for them to do. And I, twice I got that it's best for them to postpone it, not to put it so close to the crown i think that it will i, I this is logically i think that it will be a, a, just right after the crown the crown will not make it be look better only worse because the crown is still a very a, very high a, 
very um, high end uh, series. A lot of money was put into it. They you they did a lot uh, in regarding to uh, to the uh, clothing and the uh, everything around the filming of the crowd. They used high end. Um, uh, actors, uh, the all comparison between the crown and this docu series will go uh, to uh, towards the crown and not towards the docu series. And the crown has a lot of problems as it is, so I don't think that leaning on something that is already problematic is going to help them. So, but let's see what is the general idea. What is what is their general idea about this? And what we're getting is here is the five of cup. So they are desperate. This is all a part of their desperation. They are desperate. Usually it is an unjustified desperation because usually when uh, the five of cups comes, uh, it's a person that doesn't see the good things behind him, only the bad things that are in front of him. And right now, this is what Netflix see. They are in a desperate mode. They haven't decided yet but they are desperate because they know that this uh, series is not good. They know that people won't want to watch it. And people from the beginning aren't saying that they don't want to watch it because it's the Sussexes. So now it doesn't even have any kind of attraction in it. So this is a despair. This is desperation. This is a inability to trust the Sussexes in any way whatsoever. So one of the reasons for them to put it out right now is because they want it over with. So first of all, this is the main uh, energy around them. It doesn't tell us if it, they will postpone it or not, but they are desperate around it. They already paid the money or most of the money uh, not even to the Sussexes, but to the other people that worked on this uh, docu-series. It came out very boring, it's not interesting, and many people are not going to watch it. So they are desperate in order to make it, to make a way of people to, con to convince people to, um, to watch it. So what is their main... Um, obstacle, what is disturbing them the most, and what we're getting here is the Knight of Pentacles. So first of all, we can look at the Knight of Pentacles from several angles. The first angle is the people that are supposed to watch uh, this docu-series, docu and people today are not watching everything that they have. They have so many things they can choose from, why would they choose something that is boring and by people that they are not trusting. So they people know that they cannot trust a word that is said in that docu-series. They know that all we will see is what is up on the surface. We won't see anything behind the surface. And they people are just hesitant to, to watch this. So... This is one thing that Netflix will have to find a way to sell this docu-series in a very good way in order to, uh, to convince people that, uh, that they want to watch it or that they will watch it. Now, here we see the busy bee. And the busy bee, that is Netflix, that is the people that worked on that docu-series who tried in every way to put the pentacle in, in the middle. But in, in reality, it actually did not happen because a bee is a very small creature and as much as work as, they, as she might do, she won't be able to make it a bigger, a bigger pentacle than it is. So maybe there is one gem that is hiding within that docu-series, but it is a gem that will be very 
very, it will be very hard to find. So altogether, this card shows us that they need to uh, get over the fact that people will be hesitant in looking into this, uh, into this uh, docu-series. This is a card of people that get bored. And if we have, if we're watching something that is boring from the beginning, then it, it just shows us that the 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 uh, uh, target audience is bored from the beginning because we are all bored with the Sussexes. Let's say the truth: the Sussexes are boring, and this card only shows us how bored people will be, and that is why uh, we won't be able. Uh, people won't won't go to see to watch it. So. Netflix are very worried about that. They need to get people start working and not procrastinating. They need to find a way to put more pentacles into the hive. And they need to find a way of making that docu-series more interesting. But the main issue is that people are getting bored with the Sussexes and this series will not change that. Okay. So that is the obstacle. What is in the basis of all of this? And the basis of all of this is the Eight of Cups. And the Eight of Cups is a card that tells Netflix to let go. And I think that this is what Netflix did uh, at the end when they realized that they cannot control that docu-series and they just let it go do whatever you want, you can, do whatever you, you're able to do and just give us the uh, finished product. We'll see what we do with it. But uh, Netflix are not interested in it anymore. They're looking forward. So this docu-series is something to, they need to just get over with. And this is what the Eight of Pentacle, of Cups is talking about. It's talking about leaving the struggle, leaving everything behind them. This is a lot of emotions were in this because it is Cups, but it is also a card that shows us that they are unable to fight with the Sussexes any longer. And they cannot, they cannot move the Sussexes in order to make them more active, to make them more people that are doing something. So they feel that the best way to handle this is just let it go, let the universe decide. And this is one of the reasons why they want it over with. They want to uh, just broadcast that and that's it and just put it behind them and tell the Sussexes goodbye. So this is the underlying uh, energy. And the, the next card is not exactly the known effects, but it's the, the scratch that they have. So this is a, a negative card from the beginning. This is what is in their Netflix mind that is negative about this uh, series. And what we're getting here is judgment. So Netflix realized that producing some, some kind of a, a docu-series about a couple is something that takes time. This is the butterfly that comes out of the cocoon and this is why we got... And if you did, please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, leave me a comment, and I apologize in advance for, for all of the noise that were in the video. Sorry. So I'll see you in the next one. Bye.